Hi guys, good morning, sort of. I'm on about four hours of sleep. It is exactly seven o'clock. And you say, Michelle, it's exactly seven o'clock and you're going to Epcot today. Why aren't you trying to get the virtual queue for Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind like you said you were going to? Because I'm a schmoohead. Remember those motion sickness bands that I was going to bring so I could test all of this and, ooh, wasn't that going to be exciting? Yeah, they're at home. I also forgot socks and part of my underwear at home. Don't be me. Don't be me. Arlene will laugh at you if you are me. The number of times in the last, I guess, six hours that I've gone through my suitcase and my stuff and gone, wait a minute, where's, wait, what happened to the, oh, mother, yeah. Um, at 7 o'clock, we are uh, minutely behind schedule because Arlene is still getting dressed, but that's okay. We, uh, I'm going to head downstairs in just a moment to go get beignets, especially because I'm not going to do the virtual queue. And again, I'm kicking myself about that. I may ask them uh, if they're willing to let me go ahead and attempt to uh, walk the line but not do the ride. I would love their permission to do that. No guarantees, you know, with the way the line is. And I don't necessarily want to stand in an hour walking a line that I'm not riding. Um, although it would be air conditioning, so who knows. But that's, that's where we are now. So, boo. But beignets. So instead what we're going to do, uh, I've got my schedule on my phone. It's, it's wildly color coordinated as you would expect. It is not awful, but then of course it's a much shorter trip. For those of you playing along, that's the initial game plan. Realize that most of this will f get completely thrown out the, out the window if we're done. That's day one, that's gone. So we're looking at uh, yellows are, hold on, I'll tell you in a second. Yellows are a food, a tentative food. Reds are dining reservation. So the dining reservation we have is Coral Reef. The dining reservation we're hoping to try to walk up and get is Space 220. So uh, the game plan is I get beignets, we go rope drop, we try to do Ratatouille early uh, with her DAS to make sure that um, we don't have to wait forever for that. <laughs> Possibly get the breakfast arepas if they still exist over in uh, Epcot, over on that side of the world. Uh, they're going away with the Flower and Garden Festival. And then um, travel through the the see what else we want to see but basically kind of low-key it um not low-key low-key haha uh -huh. um but that's where we are right now so yeah um we were talking about potentially taking a break midday and especially with the heat and especially with what's been going on with what i've been forgetting we may legitimately do that and then go back in the evening um I hate missing that much time in the park, but we may go do one of the uh, Disney outlets. We may uh, get me socks and underwear. Uh, don't know. We'll, we'll play that one by year. So that's, that's where we are. Yeah. Beignets. Must happen. Let's make some magic. I, wow. Best laid plans of mice and men. Dagnabbit. This is our view. Looks like there's a little fire pit circle, little gas lamps. Down there is the room of the stranger. I tried to break into his room last night because I had the wrong room number. We're on the top floor, which is great. So nobody's walking over our heads. And then you turn over into the center get the elevator. It is already a little hot and humid. I do like the flowers that you have. Like some of these rooms have the privacy of the, uh, the trees. I know they're not bougainvilleas, but they feel like it. And actually, we'll take the, we want to take, let's take the stairs down this time. Is it a little lake? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's, that's the uh, river over there. And I, I love that little arch. See, it's very pretty here. The river itself is out that way. The full on oh, oops, that was silly mess. Hmm? This would be a nice walk. Mm. C 
sea serpent with triton, so it's sort of a little mermaid-ish. Yep, that's the dock right there. At 10 o'clock, the boats will start going to Disney Springs. But for now, we're off to get our breakfast beignets. What is life without breakfast beignets, you know? But it's nice and quiet here. Now, I've been to this pool bar with Drew, and what I will do for those of you who follow along, I will put a link to that video, if I can remember to, right here. Big little gators playing their instruments. And this is the walk we did. Well, what we did last night is we came out to the corner here and went that way to get to our building. We just kind of went around the square this time. So they have playgrounds. They have that pool behind me. As I said, that's the main shop. There's also uh, an arcade, a gaming arcade over there. Sasagula. That's the breakfast place for breakfast, lunch, dinner type place. That's where they've got that special gluten-free cupcake that we're going to see if we can try while we're here. And then, of course, beignets. So, sadly, the cappuccino here was cold. We tried three times, and every single thing was cold. The coffee maker is, is not keeping stuff hot. So Arlene has gone over to Sassagola Float Works to get coffee for the morning. Um, it is 7.46 now. We're not going to make rope drop. Um, I had... I had hoped to kind of be on the road faster than this, but it, it is what it is, you know. Um, but I'm just really disappointed in myself. I didn't even bother trying to get the Guardian's virtual time because I'm like, I, I know at this point, if I don't have my motion sickness bands and I didn't pack the drama mean with me, yeah, not a good plan. Not a good plan at all. Um, so we're still tested. When we, uh, I'm gonna see if we can go out and pick up more bands while we, when we go out later today, um, potentially out into the outside world to pick up all the other things I forgot to pack. Uh, yeah. And uh, yeah, I'm in that weird little haze between so exhausted that I can't quite function yet and sugar high. Like my head's tingling from the sugar high. All right, so Arlene is back. We're gonna get our act moving, and we're gonna see you on the way to the mouse. The dragon. I guess we're really going to a dragon today. Yeah, we're going to a dragon today. We just pulled into Epcot, so we're technically here right around. But not quite. Bonus staying at French Quarter. This is the uh, bus pickup for Epcot. That's it, though. We're like the closest, which I didn't think would be possible. Like, we got six, which is gonna be a really good one, but we're five. This is the awesome spot. We're getting her vehicle out of, and then we're gonna go through security, and I can't have you out through security, so I'm gonna wait until we get through, and then we'll start having some fun. This could be good. This could be good. Everything I've forgotten. The fact that I can't try Guardians because I just don't trust my stomach. We're going to make fun out of this. We're not going to make fun of it. We're going to make fun out of, you know. See? Little pretty moments. And just cause... We're going to take the annual pass holder entrance. Because we can. This is the end of Flower and Garden Festival. All of this beautiful festive 50th fun will be done by July 4th, the day I leave. So we'll be here on the last physical day of this event. And this is why you do staying on property. 30 minute standby wait for test track. Doesn't happen, guys. And the park is now open, so everyone's coming in. This is pretty awesome, guys. Look how fat we're just walking right in. That's the way you want to do it. 
so he's got in line. Like what, 8, 8, 23, we will walk on over. It has been less than 20 minutes and we're about to board. Time to go build a car here. Station number two. First thing you do, tag your band and pick your air language. Tag your band, your magic band. And then, yep. You're gonna go, you wanna go exciting. Each time you make a choice. Yep, good, you got it. That's just what's bizarre. Alright, we're going bizarre with today's guys. I don't know. Ah. We want to show it for Let's go for it. We have a very bizarre looking vehicle, but we want to miss it. Monitoring road surface. Capability test results displayed and verified. I'm number now let's three. see how your vehicles I'm have when it comes to their efficiency. I miss the acid room in a water room. Engaging eco scan for aerodynamic aero impact. So we just finished coming off of the ride. It was so much fun. Arlene went shopping. So they have these things here where you can pose with different images and stuff. And I have done that once. Maybe I'll bring Marlene back in here at some point so she can try this. Because it really is kind of fun and you don't have to actually ride the cars at all. Like you don't do the ride, you can just enjoy it. They're pollinators. They're pollinators. Name that ride at Disney. So pretty, so pretty. So we are in jolly old England. Uh, she is actually going to get some cold infusion tea right now. We are on our way to Ratatouille. It is 9.22, our fast pass or lightning lane DAS time was from 8.47 to 
so we're perfectly in time. Uh, she did some shopping. I picked up the bag that I met. Again, I don't know what order these are coming out in, uh, but from Disneyland where I was talking about how I wanted to get the Pride bag. I didn't want to pay full price when I was at Disneyland because they won't honor my annual pass here, there. So waited, got the annual pass discount here, but luckily they still had it even though Pride Month was over. So I'm excited. And, and at some point I'll maybe put a picture in, I'll let you see it later. Um, right now the countries are pretty empty because, of course, everyone's down in Guardians and Test Track and that kind of stuff and they haven't filtered their way up yet. Um, it is already 81 degrees, sunny, hot and sweaty. It's not unbearable, but it's hot. But Arlene's there, so we're going to start heading over to Ratatouille. Right, we're going to do da do da Guess what ride we're going to, Ratatouille. It is a 35 minute wait, however, when we got into the park, but it already had its own line, we did get a DAS pass for Arlene, and that meant that we would come back between 8.47 and now. We're still within the now. We're gonna hit the restroom. Skyliner! And then we're gonna head onto the road. Three's Ratatouille adventure. Ooh, and a photo op right here, which we're gonna get. Disability access line. This is also the Lightning Lane queue. It is not as much storyline, obviously, as the others, but it is. Oh, oh you did get some bones. Awesome. But it is quick and empty. So if you're in the regular lane, the line would be over there. But now we're here on this side, and this is a cut through. But it is nice and romantical. Oh, all of the pictures are animated. It's like we're in Harry Potter or something. Or not all of them, but a good chunk of them. A shuttle rider option. Is the shuttle rider option functional now? No, not yet. We just use it as a way for us to get around. Maybe we'll open one day. Here. One day. So there are 3D glasses. Don't I look fabulous? And. And the Arlene. Definitely look fabulous too. There you go. So, with the DAS, we're in within like five minutes, maybe ten tops. Right now, I mean, it's, it's early enough in the day, but we're, we're doing good. It's very pretty. As we are under the grates in the rat world. La la. And the person helping us onto the ride was actually from France. Like, legitimately. So, woohoo, they're starting to bring people back. Our rat has arrived.
Ecclesia update. Ah. Um, so yeah, so we were in, oops, sorry, the car that was mostly in the middle. It was the first car in terms of the load, but when we got into the first room, we were the dead center room, and I was in the front row rather than the back row this time. Huge difference. That was, um, and yes, I have hand sanitized. Um, huge difference for nausea. I had my eyes closed for at least a third of that ride. So yeah, I probably might need to drama me just for the heck of it, you know? The heck of it? You know what I mean. Um, yeah, that, that was not pleasant actually. It's a cute story. I got to see a, some more detail and see some stuff from different angles. And hopefully I added some of the footage in here, but yeah. Yeah. Tummy's not happy with me. So, yeah, Guardians of the Galaxies is a real, real no-go. Um, we'll see. I might look at uh, doing uh, the drama meet to try some of the other rides and see what that'll do. Or we may go off property today to hit a CVS or a Walgreens or something to pick up supplies that we need. Uh, socks. Underwear. And motion sickness bands. Because... Because I didn't seem to pack the world with me. Because what was I thinking? I think you just got hit with a piece of flour. Um, so yeah, we're sitting off to the side. Arlene is uh, taking uh, use of the facilities while I relax in the shade. The line is starting to back up for Ratatouille. I'm going to say... That looks like it's at least an hour. I'll have to check the wait time. Let me see if I can pull those up. So it's a 50 minute wait for Ratatouille right now. It was 35, I think, when we walked up. It is 10 o'clock in the morning. Park opened at 8.30, so in an hour and a half, and it's a holiday weekend. I mean, it's not as packed as it has been, as it could be, but it's still pretty darn busy. And what I will do right now is filter to just Epcot for the moment. So, oh, Spaceship Earth is still closed. That was closed this morning when we came up. So it is still, sorry, my glasses fell. It is still closed. Um, test track is at 60 and I've already done that. Frozen is at 50, but we might do that later. Uh, what we're gonna try to do right now, what, what we're gonna be heading over to Space 220. Cause we're gonna see if we can kind of rope drop that and get our names in to sit probably at the lounge so we don't have to do the full menu if we don't want to. Um, but just to see what they've got for lunch, just to see what that experience is like, because I think that would be really, really cool. Um, so yeah, that's where we are. That's where we are. Uh, if you're having fun with this, uh, you know, help me support me in the channel. Go ahead. It doesn't cost you a dime. All you have to do is hit that like button and subscribe to the channel to hit the bell notification so you know when other videos are coming out and watch them. I, I prefer you actually watch them, but you know, if you just let them run, that would probably help me too. It's not really the best. Watch them. Uh, also, if you have comments, you know, if you have a great thought or something, just write them in the comments. That comments actually really help me. You respond and I respond back to you. It makes the, the actual video or the vlogs more visible to everybody else. So it is actually a real benefit. So I'm just keeping my eye out for our lead. So yeah, I mean, anything you can do to help the channel, if you're enjoying it and you want to help me share this, I'd, I'd appreciate it, I really would. And, and I thank you for just being here and enjoying this experience with me. I want to see the blue outfit. I want blue, not pink, blue. Okay guys, there is like traffic of people coming in, but this is 10.38 on July 2nd, the Saturday of July 4th weekend. It's bloody empty. This is nuts. It should be much more crowded than this. We are gonna finish up here, and we're probably gonna take a break at the hotel. I know. Not stay in a park all day, Michelle? What are you thinking? We're gonna take a break, we're gonna go back to the hotel, we're gonna come back, because we've got an eight o'clock dinner reservation at Coral Reef. I wanna see the uh, July 4th lights on the globe tonight. So yeah, we got, got stuff, we might even hit the pool. How's that for exciting? Oh, and just in time, because there's a storm a-coming. Oh, space is for everybody. That's our future, new frontier out there.
Guys, that was awesome, but looking at the clouds in the sky and the fact that we've just had a big meal and we've just had a big busy morning and it's hot, we are headed out of the parks and we are headed back home. That's it, we're gonna head to the resort, we're gonna chill at the resort for a little while. We're gonna walk by Guardians of the Galaxy to do so, I believe. Because I don't think they closed off that path yet, have they? We're gonna go get photos on the way. Okay, we're not riding, you guys. But I thought I'd show you what Guardians of the Galaxy looks like. So it's a very dark gray building. That's fine. And look at that machine. Oh, oh, and are you guys in line? Okay, are you in line? Okay. I just want to look at this ship, isn't that awesome? Um, like shoes, but yeah, good stuff. Oh, and by the way, I don't have a tagline. Singing hey ho, a maiden's life, one, two, three. Hey ho, a maiden's life, won't you drink with me?